when I'm making them, I try to do what we see in the ancient artifacts, and that is incorporate changes in expression that will appear when the masks present at certain angles to the audience. I'll demonstrate this with my slave mask. The first thing to notice is the asymmetry of the face. So you can see there's a difference in his eyebrows, one side coming down lower than the other, and in the side of the, the nose, and in the top of the moustache part of the trumpet beard. All this means that his left side is quite different from his right side. And this affects the way that the mask works. He also has cross eyes, 